Hi everybody. Um, I don't know if my camera is in the right place or not, but we're going to go for this. I was, uh, welcome to my station, Sheila McNabb, and uh, I am doing an embellishment jar. I uh, hauled these from the uh, uh, surplus store in uh, Kitchener, where I was with Tina. And um, what I've done so far is I've taken bling, sheets of bling, and cut it down. And I'm now just using it for the walls of the jar. Um, I've seen somebody else do this and uh, hopefully um, I'll be able to uh, kind of copy what she did a little different because she did a um, little different on the outside but anyways so I put some uh, little bit of this uh, um, you know filler in the bottom and I'm going to start to fill this with um, things that I've cut out so I cut out these little um, I don't know why this is so dark anyways wait a minute I'm just gonna move this up a little bit that's a little better okay I cut these little um, tags out so I'm going to stick them in there and then I'm going to uh, add a little bit of and this stuff is hard to get out filler again to that not too much because I've got a lot of stuff to put in here okay the next thing I want to do is I've cut a lot of stuff but let's do whoops buttons and uh, I had a big sheet of buttons and I I um, cut them down so I'm going to put some buttons in here and then I have a sorry then I have a bag full of buttons and I'm going to throw some of those in got lots of buttons and uh, then I'm going to put a piece of bling in there that I had uh, that was extra from what I cut off and then I'm going to put in these little um, puzzle pieces if I can find them all there's some more buttons and there's more puzzle pieces and there should be more puzzle pieces I don't know where they went to okay uh, I was organized to start with but I um, somehow didn't stay organized okay now I'm gonna put some flowers in there put those in and uh, more puzzle pieces I got quite a few here and I have some hearts which I'm going to stick in there these I want to leave that's where my other pen went um, it's a birthday theme thing so I'll put those in there and then I cut out some of these Mickey Mouse squares and put those in there okay now I gotta put some more of this stuff in this jar is gonna be pretty full I'm uh, putting in some paper clips, some that I've done and some that just she wanted some big paper clips so these aren't exactly the ones that she was looking for but that's all I could find for right now 
so I'm putting these in there. And I'm going to give her some of these multicolored ones. That's making it look nice. Okay. I guess I could put all of these in here. It's getting pretty close to the top. Okay, I need a little bit more of this. Oh, man. I gotta tell you, this stuff is like murder to get out of that little package. I should have bought a bigger package and then I wouldn't have to try so hard. Okay. So that's pretty much all I can get in to this jar. And I have one more thing. I made her a bracelet, so I'm going to lay that right on top. So that's my embellishment jar that I put embellishments in. And uh, now the lid, I'm going to decorate. Get all this stuff in. Now I thought uh, I would put this unicorn I don't know whether I want to put it there or I want to put it on the side of the jar. And I think I want to do it on the side of the jar. These are pretty sticky too. So, I will put that there. So you can see that I have the little, oh, sorry, little embellishment on the jar. So that's good. Now, I have some washi tape here a minute ago that was in the blues. Sure, I took it out, but, you know. want something a little wider. And the blue would be good for pink. Uh, I don't really like any of these. I really like this color, but I don't know if I have enough to go around that jar or not. I'll leave that out for a minute. Got another wide one here. Uh, I have no idea what's on that, but it's not blue, so I'm not, no. I must have 50,000 washi tape, and you know, when I go to find one, uh, can't find any, but I kind of really like this one. And I don't know what happened to the other one that I had out. Anyways, whatever I did with it, it's not there anymore. So I'm going to take this. Now she took ribbon and put ribbon around it. But um, I'm wanting to use up some of my washi tape that, you know, I have thousands of washi tape and I never use it for anything and this should be just right to go around there so I'm going to put this around God, I have just enough. Perfect. Okay. I'm 
Now that's the washi tape around there. And that brings in the turquoise and the blue and the pink and the um, unicorn. Now what I need is something for the top. And I have these flowers. And I was going to put them on the top. But they're kind of small. And I'm thinking I need something bigger. These are bigger, a little bit. Well, I tell you, these are hard to cut. There we go. Maybe I need two of them, and I got two on this card. Her favorite color is blue, like me. So I'm trying to do uh, blues. This will go with the, um, well, that's more of an aqua color, isn't it? No, I don't like that. I want to use something that's... Uh, Well, girls, I'm sorry I'm not in the video uh, where you can see me, but I am looking for some uh, really kind of big flower. Okay, I'm back, and uh, oh. I'm kind of into this, uh, these little things and decorating them, and I don't like these scissors, so I'll get those ones out and put those ones back. Sometimes I have scissors that I just don't care about. And I am going to um, take off the ones that don't have anything on them. Sometimes these balls fall off and I don't like to leave like this one where there's and so that all you see is, uh, oh, well, I didn't cut that one too good, but that's all right. I could put that one on here. Sorry, I'm out of frame again. Okay. So now we have a full uh, 
looking. 